Hey, my name is Chenjirai Maiswa, a councillor elect for Mberengwa Ward 5, called Mureres. Uh, I want to thank uh, the Mureres community for according support to me uh, and SANPF at large. Uh, that is to say, here in Mberengwa, we managed to vote in our MP from ZANPF, our president from ZANPF, our councillor from ZANPF. So I want to thank uh, the people of this community for supporting us, for supporting uh, the, this leadership. This is my second term. Uh, uh, I started in 2018 when I was 35 years old, and I want to still thank the new dispensation that accorded the youth a chance to, to represent, to show their vision uh, in their areas. Uh, where they would spearhead development, uh, where they would liaise with uh, youth uh, of their age and encourage them to participate in the development of their area. Uh, in my second term, uh, I have got a vision. Uh, I think most of the projects we will do, it will be a completion of the project we started in 2018. In 2018, uh, we managed uh, to construct a community hall at Murez Ward Center. Uh, where we think and expect that uh, youth uh, and vulnerable women uh, must come uh, for training, uh, for learning a lot of things. Uh, the community uh, will provide uh, accommodation uh, for we used to go to Sushavane, Mataka, Mbiyane, Andra, since we didn't have any infrastructure for, 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 for learning. And we have already started uh, those programs where youth are, are, are learning short courses being given uh, certificates, utilize those, those useless and those certificates to get uh, 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 jobs. Uh, secondly, uh, we initiated the construction of two clinics, namely uh, Poland Clinic and uh, 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 Runde Clinic. Uh, where else uh, Runde Clinic is at uh, slab level and the Poland Clinic is at foundation level. So, uh, in my second term, uh, I want to push to complete those uh, two clinics. Uh, I think by 2028 they must be operational. Uh, that is to meet uh, guidelines given by the Minister of Health that no one must travel more than five kilometers to a health facility. In the case of community, we managed to complete it. It's now a complete, it's now being used by the community and the community is very happy about that. And also, I'm thinking of, uh, uh, in consultation with the community of Mreres uh, uh, and in line with the vision of the president of drilling a uh, the balls in each and every village. I think if uh, people of Mureres can be assisted by uh, getting a ball in each and every village, it will be a milestone towards development in our community. I think uh, for, for now, I can mention those projects, that's the projects I can mention for now, uh, that we've got the zeal as a community uh, to have. Uh, and I think uh, uh, we've got enough primary schools in this, uh, in this ward, we have, uh, we have got about four of them in two secondary schools. Uh, people in our community are not traveling long distance to, to the education uh, facilities. Yeah, I think they are a bit enough, I can, I, I can say that. Uh, so I want to thank uh, Dr. Idi Munangagwa uh, for allowing, even in, in this uh, term, 2023 term, uh, he allowed the youth quota in parliament, he allowed the women's quota in parliament. Also, he introduced the women's quota in a, a local authority, which is a great milestone in, in fulfilling uh, the constitution of Zimbabwe, in, in fulfilling uh, the expectations from the United Nations in terms of uh, assisting women, putting them in leadership.